In this problem, we need to determine how many liters of a new solution we can prepare from a stock solution of the sodium hydroxide, which is 400 milliliters and 3.6 molar. So these two together, this is the stock solution, the concentrated solution. And what we're trying to prepare is a new solution, which will have a concentration of 0.35. So pay attention here, 3.6, 0.35. It is diluted. The concentration went down. So we're trying to find how many liters of that solution we can prepare. So here again, we're going to use the formula for the dilution, which is equal to M1 times V1 is equal M2 times V2. Now we know the M1, which is 3.6 molar, the V1, we're going to take 400 milliliters of the stock solution and pairing a new solution, which is 0.35 molar. So trying to find the V2. V2 is equal here, if we just rearrange this equation a little bit, is equal to M times multiplied by V1, and we're going to divide this by the final concentration of the solution. So at this point, we just need to put the numbers. So M1, 3.60 moles per liter, multiplied by the volume, which is 400.0 milliliters and we're going to divide this by the final concentration which is 0 0.350 moles per liter cancel the units of the concentration and so our answer is equal to 4114.2 milliliters so what we want to do here is pay attention to the significant figures we have three significant figures we have four and we have three here so our answer need to be three significant figures which means that we're going to keep these three numbers here and drop these two so this is equal to 4110 milliliters now in the last step we need to convert this to milliliters so the volume in liters will be equal to 4110 milliliters multiplied by this conversion factor so every 1000 milliliters correspond to one liter okay so cancel the milliliters and we have 0 0.411 liter of the final solution